James. Hi, Hi nice to meet you. Yeah, My name's Howard, Howard from Dubious Engineering. And you have here what looks very much like a jet engine. It certainly is a jet engine. That's amazing. That is absolutely fantastic. There's been there's an awful lot of stuff here at the, at the show, and, and, and some of it is art, and some of it is precision engineering. This is absolutely fantastic. Can you tell us a little bit about it? A little bit we can indeed. Yeah, okay. We've got uh, a fairly simple system. Yeah. Uh, we're using actually a compressor, a centrifugal compressor which comes actually out of a turbocharger okay uh, which means there's no work to do on that essentially it's something you buy off the shelf and so yeah yeah we, a we got a research. turbocharger yeah, out of an yeah. engine okay yeah. great yeah so yeah. we then yeah. have at the back end yeah. a axle flow turbine which is specially made okay. out of uh, a material called Inconel yep now yep, this yep. is the same material that's used in full-sized uh, jet engines so yep. it puts up with the extreme centrifugal forces and, and the, the very heat. high temperatures yeah, that are absolutely. passing through yeah, yeah, yeah. now we also have a vaporizing combustor okay uh, and what that's so using that is kerosene mixes the kerosene with the air what and it's then, doing okay, is yeah. actually heating the kerosene first right, to turn okay. it into a vapour. Vapor. Okay, gotcha. So okay. it then yeah. mixes yeah. with the air yeah. Yeah. and yeah. as it emerges from, yeah. it's just a simple tube, yeah. or a series of tubes, and yeah. as it comes out the end, the fuel and the air is mixed up and it joins the burning, essentially a donut of fire around right. the front of the combustion chamber. Okay. So that's producing very nearly 2,000 degrees mm. of heat. Okay. But we're only using a very small percentage, maybe less than 20% of the air that's actually been sucked in. Okay. So the rest of the air is now mixed with that very, very hot gas. Yeah. So it all expands tremendously. That that heat uh, makes that air expand. Okay. And the only and way is to come out through that the turbine. What drives the, uh, the 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 combusted uh, fuel out the back end? Out the back end. And and effectively then would turn that into forward propulsion. I suppose. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, one one of the sort of misconceptions often is the turbine is there driving the engine along. It's right. not. It's yeah. actually absorbing energy okay. of that hot gas passing through it right. in order to drive the compressor. Okay. So it's actually okay. taking yeah, yeah, away yeah. energy yeah. Yeah. from what we would use for our propulsive uh, force, okay. the thrust. Okay, fantastic. So, so, so just, what, what? I mean, obviously, you know, this is all quite complicated. We'll get some footage of all of, all, yeah, of, of yeah. some of your, if you don't mind, of yeah, course, yeah, yeah. We'll get some footage of, of your setup. Yeah. So what, what have we got here? I mean, you've got a computer, you've got a laptop with lots and lots of um, uh, displays it looks like maybe temperatures and pressures and absolutely yeah okay what we use this for this is basically a research and development rig yeah but at shows like this it's quite handy because yeah. it enables people to see some of the real numbers okay, uh, okay. I, yeah. you can tell people what yeah. it's doing yeah yeah uh, but yeah. they don't often believe it but when they see it with their own eyes yeah. uh, the, well, the numbers reeling up I heard I heard the thing running earlier and and um, yeah, it's uh, it's it's quite scary um, in a, in a really good way. It's good, way, good scary. Yeah, yeah. The display this that you got here then this this uh, sorry is an LCD display here that's uh, got uh, revs per minute and temperature on it. Yeah. And uh, PW is a pressure. It is actually power. power. That's the power right. of the battery driving, particularly things like the pump okay. and the starter motor. Right. Okay. So okay. So you've got a start. So this, uh, this then is a motor yep. that spins up the turbo blades. Yep. yep. Exactly. You need to get those spinning before they before start they to self, self self sustain. Okay, yep, right. Yep, yeah, yep. yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Yep. And it does that uh, on this particular engine. Yeah. It has to achieve that starter motor has to get up to uh, over twenty four thousand RPM. Wow before there's enough energy in that turbine to be able to drive that compressor. Yeah, gotcha. On an engine like this, it's difficult to believe, but that turbine at full power right. has to deliver very nearly 20 brake horsepower to really? that compressor to drive the compressor. Really? So it's actually taking most of yeah. the energy that you're putting into it yeah, to, to, and, actually, and, yeah, yeah, to yeah. actually drive itself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then yeah. You, yeah, the thrust is really the waste product. It's the excess. It's exactly, <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So, and then obviously it looks like you've got a couple of little JK thermocouples kicking around or something yeah, along yes, those lines. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, 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 just yeah, 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 monitor yeah, yeah. the... Monitor uh, various bits. Yeah, yeah. One, one is actually directly to the yeah. controller circuit. So right. this little box here, it controls
controls the entire engine. Okay, the right. The computer yeah. is there purely yeah. for research and development. Yeah, just and so you can not see what's going on, monitoring, yeah, okay. everything that's yeah, going yeah, on. Yeah, yeah. And the other one actually is connected to that, so right. it's not actually connected to the yeah. um, the running system. Yeah, it's yeah, the monitoring yeah, system. Yeah, yeah. So we also have uh, a fuel pump here, yeah. which is just a little gear pump, and that's taking the fuel right from, through, the, from the bottle, uh, yeah. pressurizing it. Yeah. Um, we've got a, 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 a couple of flow meters here, okay. so we can actually determine the flow. Yeah. And the reason there's two yeah. is because there's a T-junction here and a restrictor. Yes. And that is for the lubricant flow to the bearings. Right, okay, so you running, need to make sure yeah, those yeah, bearings yeah, are well running, lubricated. Yeah. Yeah. So yeah. we yeah. see yeah. the difference between yeah. the two flows and we yeah. know there's something going yeah. down that line. Now, all of, all, of the, all of the casing for this, I mean, yep. this is spot welded yep. here. Yep. And then uh, this casing here yeah. looks also like it's spot been... Welded. Oh, this is spot welded. I thought it would be yep. TIG welded. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And this is all, I, you, I do you, you've made all of this yourself. Absolutely, yeah, 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 completely, yeah, yeah. completely. Yeah. And how long? About, about how long would it take to uh, if you if you were to make another one of these, knowing Easy. what you know now, now? How how long would it take you to put one of these together? If you had the motivation uh, if, to well, do so, if, yeah, and, yeah, and the time to and do time, so, yeah. <laughs> a, a while then, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah. Well, if you yeah. actually worked at it solidly, yeah, you could probably get the whole thing built in a, in a, in a, well, the engine. In, let's uh, yeah. talk the engine. Yeah, uh, you could get the whole thing built in a winter season. Right. Okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. 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 Um, ready to wheel it out in yeah, the garage ready, for the summer. Ready yeah. for the summer. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. So it's one of yeah. those things that usually we don't have that much time. So it'll usually yeah. take a year or so yeah. to build one. Okay. But it can be done a lot quicker. Yeah, fantastic. <laughs> it's funny actually because when uh, you did mention earlier that it's actually quite simple and really when you look at it and uh, yeah okay it, it's not simple in the sense yeah. that it has to be very well balanced and tuned and, and 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 everything needs to be set up correctly but when you look at it I mean there's there's there's, there's a bottle of gas yep there's a bottle of, of fuel of, of fuel yeah and 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 there's a there's a there's a spinning a yeah spinning basically blade a, in a, a, bat yeah. a battery which is yeah, running there yeah, and, yeah, and that gets yeah, the whole thing yeah, going yeah. and keeps it going yeah Yes. Uh, it, so it, it is actually very, actually even in terms of in the middle there it is very very simple in and real this this piece here then that's just an exhaust to to to, to, to deflect, encourage to yeah, yeah, get yeah. the get the exhaust gases well, uh, when yeah. we first well, came the here gases yeah, away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. when we first came here demonstrating our engines uh, we were marginally unpopular because we used to burn this head <laughs> off <laughs> brilliant 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 so um, so you you're with the gas turbine, turbine. builders association that's right. Where base are you based, or are you just, well, or are you all are over the UK? All over the world. All over the world, right? Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, so yeah, we're yeah. Basically, yeah. all enthusiastic yeah. amateur model engineers were yeah. kind of you know, individuals. Yes. So we're yeah. not a company or anything. No, we're no, just no, an no. association yeah. of people. Yeah. yeah. Um, and we know we have um, a private forum on the internet. Yeah. So membership gives you access to that forum. Okay. And that's enabled us now to get members all over the world, and we have members now in four. Countries right. worldwide, right. Yeah. and yeah. these yeah. people. So yeah. our, that forum is essentially our virtual clubhouse. Yeah, yeah, okay, yeah. Yeah. brilliant, yeah. brilliant. And then, what, what sort of application might you use it? I mean, do you, would you ever consider uh, putting this in something to power it? Oh yes, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. And, yeah. and what kind of application? Model aircraft do people is what this one's des yeah, destined for. Is yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. One of one of your model aircraft. Yes. Or, yes. Yeah? Yes. Yeah. yeah, yeah okay. Yeah, right. Yeah. So, okay, you're an RC guy as well. Uh, yeah, yes, yeah, yes. Okay, well, good, that's what good, got good, me. Yeah. In. That's yeah. what got me into this in yeah. the first place. Yeah. I yeah. used to love helicopters. Yeah, yeah, helicopters. yeah, 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 yeah. And yeah. I could never understand why yeah. it was necessary for a little IC engine yeah. thrash the whole airframe from vibration. Yeah. If you had a jet engine in there, it yeah. would be so much smoother. Yeah. And that's yeah. what got me into these. Yeah. yeah. And so I sort of kind of diverted yeah. off to the jets. Yeah. And I'm starting to get back to the aeroplanes again. Yeah. Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. <laughs> so you've got a number of aeroplanes. Yeah. I guess yeah, the, yeah. With, with, with these in. With these in. Have you? Yes. That's absolutely yeah, fascinating. Yeah. Thanks, James. Really right, appreciate pleasure. it.